Brewing beer in Thailand began in 1933 with the granting of a brewing license to 57-year-old Freya Baram Bhakti, born Boon Rod Sreshtaputra. His company, Boon Rod Brewery, produces Thailand's oldest and best-known lager, Singa, pronounced Sing. Singa is sold in Thailand in standard 5% ABV, light 3.5% ABV, and draft versions. Singa largest competitor is Chong beer, made by Thai beverages. Chong is noted globally for its sponsorship of Liverpool's Everton Football Club, as its name and logo have appeared on the team uniform since 2004. The Thai Asia Pacific Brewery TAPB, at its Nandabori plant brews Heineken since 1995, Tiger, Cheers, and Cheers XTRA 6.5% ABV. It is the Thailand importer of Guinness and Kilkenny. Boon Rod Brewery also makes Leo, a standard lager 5% ABV. In addition, Thai Beverages sells Archa, a mass-market, non-premium lager. Boon Rod Brewery also sold a global brand called Mitvida, but this was replaced by a beer brewed in partnership with InBev, Kloster. It also sells a 6.5% lager called Thai Beer. Other locally brewed Thai beers are Phuket Beer and Siam, both in Patham Thani Province. Siam Beer exports Bangkok beer abroad, but does not sell it in Thailand. Phuket beer and Federbrau are the only Thai beers brewed in accordance with the German purification law, the Reinheitsgebot. Phuket Lager received the first gold medal ever for a beer from Thailand at the 2006 Mond Selection Awards. Classic beer is another local beer brewed in Patham Thani Province. Although foreign beers are popular in Thailand, the government protects its domestic breweries by the imposition of import duties up to 60%. In addition, all imported beer must bear an import sticker on the bottle cap. As a result, Thai brewers have entered into partnerships with Western brewers, such as Carlsberg's former partnership with Thai Beverages, since abrogated, or Asahi's partnership with Boon Rod. Economics in the past, the economics of beer market in Thailand were stable but last year it grew because almost all companies in Thailand such as Singa Corporation Co., Chong Beer, Import and Craft Beer are having a new idea to sell beer like Beer Garden, produce a new beer that makes people want to try new things. Even though mainstream beer in Thailand is more than 80% and costs is 1.800 thousand million. Nowadays, super premium beer is less than 1% but it will rise up quickly because new generation of consumers likes to try and taste something new, so that according with trend of the beer market in worldwide. Thailand has two big companies. It's Boon Rod Brewery and Thai Beverages. Turnover of two companies Thai Beverages 2012 income 34,386 million baht loss 1,256 million baht 2013 income 32,935 million baht loss 447 million baht 2014 income 35,193 million baht profit 396 million baht 2015 income, 43,112 million baht profit, 1,215 million baht 2016 income, 44,397 million baht profit, 2,780 million baht Boon Rod Brewery 2012 income, 98,990 million baht profit, 3,115 million baht 2013 income, 105,563 million baht profit, 3,256 million baht 2014 income, 113,897 million baht profit, 2,915 million baht 2015 income, 116,548 million baht profit, 2,310 million baht 
2016 income, 104,794 million bot profit, 770 million bot in the past year proportion is Leo 53% Chong 38% Singa 5% All the above reasons make us know why economics of beer market in Thailand are growing. Even super premium beer group is rising up, but cost will be increasing again because it will bring 2% to elderly fund followed by new law. If you are consuming beer in Thailand, you should follow this closely. Craft beer Two types of licenses are available in Thailand for would-be beer producers. Thailand S. 1950 Liquor Act states that beer can only be made in a factory making more than 1 million liters per year or in a brewpub producing at least 100,000 liters per year for sale on site with no bottling permitted. Brewpub beers cannot be sold off premises. The Finance Ministry in 2000 ruled that, for either type of producer to be legal, they must be a limited company with capital of at least 10 million baht. The maximum penalty for home brewing under the 1950 Liquor Act used to be 200 baht for making it and 5,000 baht for selling it. A new law passed by the National Legislative Assembly in December 2016 raised the maximum penalty for illegal production to 100,000 baht or a prison sentence of six months, or both. The maximum fine for selling illegal beer was raised to 50,000 baht. To sell craft beers off-premises, one small brewer explained, we have two choices, either hire an overseas factory to make it or build a factory abroad on our own and import it. Meanwhile, military-controlled ASEAN neighbor Myanmar, in January 2017, got its first craft beer microbrewery, Burbrit. Its name is derived from Burma, and Britain, in recognition of British influence on Burma. S. Brewing History Thai Industrial Breweries Asia Pacific Breweries Boon Rod Brewery Carlsberg Heineken Phuket Beer San Miguel Brewery in Thailand, under supervision of Tropical Beverage Company San Miguel Brewery Taibev Gallery See also Beer and breweries by region References External links Media related to beers of Thailand at Wikimedia Commons Beer Jaw